All right. May the Lord bless your hearts real good. God bless all of you. All of you during this telecast. May the Lord bless you real good. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We pray that God bless you real good. Pray that God give you the desires of your heart. All right. Let's go right away. I have a video coming up later. I have a video that I'm going to post later. <clears throat> Dealing with this, but and I started to make this an attachment, but I'm going to, I'm going to, this is a prelude, a preview of what's coming later. Let's see. And I'm taking my walk this morning. Man, you listen to some of these for these folks don't believe Jesus. These folks preaching don't believe Jesus. These folks speaking in tongues don't believe Jesus. And I'm, I'm not talking about everybody, okay? These preachers don't believe Jesus. And they say they preach holiness. They don't believe Jesus. They don't believe Jesus. They, 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 they don't believe the blood of Jesus Christ clear from all sin. They don't believe that Jesus Christ take away his sin. They don't believe that. They don't believe nobody living holy. They don't believe nobody living righteous. They don't believe nobody obeying the word of God. They don't believe nobody saved from sin. All right. Let me give you an example. And I've seen this happen down through the year. Number one, number one, let me see. Don't put your sin and your disobedience on everybody. They're because you sinning and disobeying God. Don't mean everybody sinning and disobeying God. It's some people walking out of the Spirit. It's some people obeying. It's some people not compromised. Don't put your sin on everybody else. Ooh. Don't. If you in sin, preacher, don't put your sin. If you in sin, pastor, bishop, church of God in Christ, Baptist, Methodist, Apostolic, if you in sin, if you sinning, if you got sin, if you ain't perfect, meaning without sin. If you got sin, don't put that jacket on everybody. <laughs> I've seen it happen. Mandy, look, look, you listen to these folks, you look, you listen to these folks, you know we're walking victory. And actually, you will end up walking in unbelief. If you don't believe that Jesus Christ cleansed you from your sin, you are unbeliever. I've been, I've been in church where they call you. Got, you got to watch the trick of, the trick of the enemy. Hallelujah. The spirit of discern that is going forth right now. All oh, the, oh, the Holy Ghost discern that spirit. Man, these preachers. Preacher, if you don't believe what you're preaching, get out of the pulpit. But the spirit of the I'm going for right now. Man, I've been in church to where they put a guilt trip on you. Try to put a guilt trip on you because you live in holy. And they call you self-righteous because you live in holy. <clears throat> Hallelujah. <laughs> and they go on to use the scripture out of context. Well, I was right to do that fear the wrath. That's right, you're righteous. You're right to you. You don't even know what that means. 
your right that you a hypocrite. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Uh, your writing, you say tithing over it. It's what saved you. <laughs> that your righteousness. Did you hear what I just told you? And by God, they go, they go in the word of God and read that. Hallelujah. Matter of fact, I may, I'm, when I get back home, I, I may go and teach on that. Your writing is the law. Of course your right to fear the wrath. Of course your tithing and offering and Sabbath day keeping and first fruit offering this fear the wrath. Mm-hmm. And you fear the two. Cause you don't believe Jesus Christ. Anyway. Anyway. Praise God. But man, you listen to some of these preachers, you never will walk in deliverance. Well, ain't none of us perfect. So that means we all ain't nobody without sin. Well, don't act self-righteous. All of us got some area in our life to work on. But is it sin? Yeah, we have to work every day to keep our body under subjection. Yes, we got to do that and we're doing it too. Everybody ain't playing hopscotch and up and down and slipping and sliding and one day I'm up and one day I'm down and almost level to the ground. Everybody ain't like that. There's some people walking in victory. Walking out of the spirit and not after the flesh. And they put a try put a get trip on you. Oh, can't nobody say there ain't nobody that they don't have sin. You got sin, even if don't nobody know it. You got sin. What? If you repented of it and walking in the spirit, you don't have it. And we got a video coming up after this. Got a video coming up. I'm going to share. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Praise God. Hallelujah. You listen to some of these folks, ain't nobody say. They don't believe Jesus. They don't believe Jesus Christ clean from all sin. If, look, look, Jesus clean from all sin according to the scripture. Jesus take away our sin according to the scripture. But you don't believe it. You say, no, no matter how saved we are, we still got sin. I had, I had to correct a fellow, a bishop, and out of sense, had to correct it. Hallelujah. Say, well, we, the blood cover, and, and we all got sin. I said, hold it. Hold it. Stop the pressing. What did that Bible say, Bishop? In 1 John 1 9. He said, what did it say, preacher? And I told him, he said, yes, it said that. Listen to, these, listen to some of these sanctified, crankified folk, some of these so-called holy folk, you, you never will walk in victory. I don't care what you say. Hallelujah. Ah, yeah. You, 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 you ain't self-righteous. If you made right about you, if Jesus took away your sin, and you're witnessing to that, unto Jesus Christ. You ain't self-righteous because it's Jesus that cleansed me from sin. Jesus that took away my sin. A whole bad in the world. Walking out of the spirit. Not fulfilling the lust of the flesh. Mm -hmm. Resisting the devil. Hold it. You know when you sin, you didn't resist no devil. Mm-hmm. Hallelujah. Listen to some of these folk, man. Ain't nobody say. They don't believe Jesus. They don't even believe the gospel they preach. Well, ain't we all got, 
We all got some sin. We all got some. I corrected the preacher one time. Oh, we all. No, if anybody say that they ain't got nothing to work on, they are liar. Hey, is it sin? You don't work on sin. You repent of sin. Well, I, I got to work on. I'm eating a little too much. I'm, 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 I'm overweight. I got to work on I'm overweight. I eat two pieces of pie instead of one piece of pie. That ain't no sin. But it's a sin. You don't work on sin. You repent of sin. You lay aside every weight and the sin. You depart from iniquity, according to the scripture. But man, you listen to some of these folks. Ain't nobody. Ain't nobody, friend. They ain't got nothing to wake up. It's a sin. Uh-huh. Hallelujah. The blood of Jesus cleared it from all sin. It said all, not some. Hallelujah. Listen to some of these preachers, man, ain't nobody saved. And you won't be saved listening to these preachers. Hallelujah. Glory to God. All right. It, it come, to, it come, come to mind. I remember one time a preacher came one time and he preached. I understand what he was saying. He says, he says, sometimes we be more hard on ourselves than God be on us. No, we don't. No, we don't. <laughs> no, we don't. <laughs> God gonna be real hard on you. He gonna dump you in the hell. Fire and brimstone. Praise God. Hallelujah. If you fear God, you obey. But listen to some of these preachers, ain't nobody saved. Ain't nobody holy. Don't preachers, if you in sin. And you got sin, don't put that on everybody else. It's something living right and obeying the word of God. <sighs> it's something not turning to the right nor the left. But they observe and do all that the Lord commanded. Hallelujah. They keeping Jesus' commandments. They crucifying the flesh. They mind and the things of the spirit. They walk it out of the spirit. Not fulfilling the lust of the flesh. Everybody ain't got no sin. If you got sin, just say it's on you. Don't put that on everybody. Try to make yourself look good. And everybody there agree with you. Yeah, but we got some. Okay, you better repent. That's enough.